Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. Hey, guys. Um, I'm here today to show you guys the lady that said why trains shouldn't exist. And I will also show you how there are tons and tons and tons of videos about how everyone's giving her hate, which I support that. Cause I, you know, train fat 119, obviously. So I've already reacted to this one time, but I'm still gonna give my honest opinion. Lady is so stupid. Lady Lady says, also, people are still filming trains after I told them not to. You stupid idiot. They're not going to listen to you. Rail fans can rail fan trains if they want to. You do not control their life, you piece of crap. Like, would you think that everyone would just stop filming trains? Are you that stupid? Plus, it's called rail fanning. You idiot. And, oh crap, my battery. <laughs> you didn't see that. And, um, literally, people record train, film trains, and it's like their life. And if, <laughs> I don't know, it just sounds stupid. Are you actually disobeying? Oh yeah, Daisy, you're uh, you have a tiny little crown. Oh, uh, like that makes you the king of or queen of everyone, and everyone has to listen to you. I'm sorry, lady, but you are one of the lowest ranked people ever. Freaking got your life, in my opinion, sucks. It's so cringy. Which, I know there's a bunch of cringy train content, but the gotcha life cr cringe is much higher, in my opinion. Mmm, like oh no. There's another one. <laughs> trains cut, also anyways, trains cause pollution. Well, that is true, but if you idiots don't know, have you not heard of electric trains and tier 4 locomotives and eco units, which are all the, some of the newest technology? Electric trains have been around since the, I think, 1890s? So, not all trains cause pollution. Um, we don't talk, yeah, Alcos cause a whole bunch of pollution. GEs can cause a whole bunch of pollution. Um, EMDs don't cause that much pollution, but the trains still get the job done. They still carry way more than a car or a truck could ever carry. Most of the time, trains are a lot more efficient. And when you think about it, using over like 40 trucks... Or, like, 50 trucks to transport the same amount of freight that one or two locomotives could do. The trucks would still be putting out more pollution. Individually, one truck would put out, most likely put less pollution. But, times that by 50, and you get a whole lot of, whole lot more pollution from trucks. Sorry, truck fans, but it's kind of the truth. Not trying to offend you or anything. Don't you feel like that? And, and look at this. She says, oh, look at this train on fire. I'm sorry. This train, I guess you consider it on fire. But that's just like a turbocharger um, failure. That can happen. That is just a small design. That's a design flaw with some of GE's locomotives from the Dash 7 up to Dash 9. Um, stuff like this happens. Like, it's not that deadly. I mean, it's a bunch of fire coming out of the locomotive, but it's not really deadly. A few, I mean, it could possibly start a small wildfire, but you can easily put that out. 
and you can easily you can easily repair the locomotive and it'll be absolutely fine. Heck, you don't even have to give it a repaint. I've seen plenty of Dash 9s that have caught in, not, that are basically caught in fire. And you can see where they've caught in fire and they're absolutely fine. And they haven't killed anyone. If you don't live the and yeah, yeah, Scarlet literally says the fire could spread and everyone will die. I'm sorry, you stupid. Blue-haired, sonic-looking freak head. This fire is not gonna just like, ooh, oh no, a spark. It's gonna touch the pine straw. Whoa! And then everyone dies. No, that ain't gonna happen, you stupid idiot. Yeah, she says, look at this picture. Look, these people are about to get hit. Why is the track, I mean, yeah, why is the track going over the road? Track, that, oh my god. Train, it's supposed to say train, but she said track. No, you dumbo. That train is not going that fast. I've seen, I've seen like an old video of that train crossing before. The trains do not go fast through there. These are the people that are being stupid, well... I mean, they're not really being that stupid. I bet the crossing only just now came on, but they could easily, they can just stop for the train. The train's going slow enough if a car pulled out in front of it when it was right where the switch is, it could stop in about 30 seconds and do, like, minimal damage to the car. So... You could be Oh, screw off. If if you like trains, you can go to heck. I'm sorry, but... I'm... Mm, you, you guys are stupid. I'm not gonna support you. And I swear to God, if, this, if all of what I just said right now does not work, I'm gonna flip out. And none of you guys are gonna see this video. <sighs> Let's just leave it there. Leave it at that. Alright, goodbye guys.